All right, Gabe, so second day of camp. It's been really intense. I mean, scrimmages, games, you guys are off and running. How has it been for you so far? Uh, it's been good. Uh, it's a little different than uh, the summers because uh, you don't plan for this kind of a day uh, during the summer. It's usually having fun and then hitting the gym for about an hour and a half. Uh, but, you know, it's good to get in uh, going hard this early because uh, the season is going to be starting pretty soon. We got an exhibition on Monday, so uh, we kind of have to pack everything in these three days. And as tough as it, as it is, we, we have to do it. Absolutely. And so as far as the off season, I know it's a time to have a lot of fun, as it should be, because it's time to recharge your batteries. But did you do anything? Did you have any sort of workout routines program for the off season? Uh, I just stuck to the same stuff I was doing uh, the past two years uh, when I came out here because they gave me a special program because uh, I have a certain thing with my body that uh, I don't want to reveal to the public. Sure. But, uh, but it's not a bad thing. No, it's not a bad thing. <laughs> it's because I'm short. Um, no, but I just stuck to the same stuff that I've been doing uh, also with college and you know when you get used to that program it, your body is used to what you're doing, so you don't want to mix in too much uh, foreign stuff and kind of get your body saying, you know, what are you doing to me? But, uh, you know, it, it is time for a little fun, but we had a, a long off season, and yeah. sometimes the days get a little boring. You <laughs> sit down and watch the Game Show Network a little too much. <laughs> but uh, uh, Now we know your guilty pleasures. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but I had some fun. I got married this summer, so uh, Congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Um, so it was, a, it was a good off season, but uh, time to get ready, uh, start of all. August, I was really going hard, so uh, it was it was a fun summer, but also uh, hard working. Yeah. Do you keep in touch with any of the like strength and conditioning from the Kings, or do you strictly work with the strength and conditioning down at Manchester? I was working uh, Mike Muir uh, with Manchester just because I was so familiar with him sure. being in Manchester the last two years, and uh, you kind of have that relationship. Plus, he lived right down the street from me. I was in New Hampshire this summer, so. Uh, you know, if I was out here the whole summer, I'd probably be working with Chad, but because of the proximity, it's it's yeah. easier to work with uh, the guy who's with you. Sure. And as far as the new sub systems that Terry Murray has implemented, how have they affected your style, if at all? And are you are you ready to run with them? It is a it's a different system than uh, Coach Crawford's from the last two years, right. but uh, you know, Coach Murray has. Uh, a very strong system and uh, he's very defensive he likes to have uh, all the forwards play very in, uh, packed in tight and play a defensive game and he, he even told us he, he goes I want to score I want to see you guys score as many goals as you can but you got to take care of your defensive zone first and uh, that's kind of been a, a key part of my game uh, the past two years playing pro is working on defensive play so I think I'm gonna fit in pretty well uh, with this new system and uh, you know I also want to score some goals too. Well, We want to see that happen thank you so much for taking the time. You're welcome thank you. Thanks.